the way I see it, your marketing is kind of like um, backdoor, right? Hear me out on this. Because when you want it, when it's your idea and you're just kind of like, I would like that. You're relaxed, you're into it. It's a great experience and it all just works, right? Backdoor. If it is not something that you want, but someone else is kind of like bringing it up and mentioning it and trying to get you to do it and they kind of convince you to do it, but you're not really sure that it's something that you want, uh, that shit's gonna hurt. That's not gonna be a fun experience for everyone. In fact, that's probably going to be deeply traumatic. And so it's the same thing with your marketing. You've got to stop treating it like backdoor the way that some people go about trying to get that the, the, the entire wrong way where they just try to like use pressure and manipulation and guilt and but you'll really like it. It will be great or we'll just do it once or so-and-so's wife does it. You know, that type of experience is just going to lead to um, hurt <laughs> and distrust and just not a great time for anyone. Versus if you do happen to speak to said other person's wife and they're like, oh, I actually really enjoy it and this is how we do it. And then you get start you thinking about it. You start thinking about it. And you're like, oh, actually, maybe I'd like to try it. So then you bring it up and then it's good. Then it's fun. Then you're ready. You're excited. You're relaxed. It doesn't hurt. It's amazing. Everyone likes it and you get to come twice, okay? Look, and I'm just saying... <laughs> Think about your marketing in that way and you will, what is it, catch a lot, catch many, heaps more flies with honey than vinegar, something like that. Same philosophy. Your backdoor experience is probably going to be a lot more enjoyable if it comes from you and you want to do it rather than it's something that you're being manipulated and pushed into.